Hi everybody, Alex Pistana here again with Trimec, and today I have a really exciting material to show you. Now, carbon fiber is a material that has blown up over recent years in the uh, additive world. There are a ton of companies, large and small, uh, including Stratasys, that have carbon fiber offerings. Um, now, Stratasys does have a nylon 12-based carbon-filled material on their Fortis line, uh, but as of today, there was nothing available uh, for the F-Series line. So in February, Stratasys did announce the, their ABS carbon fiber material, which I have a couple samples of here today. Uh, so I'm going to talk a little bit about why carbon fiber, uh, show off some of these parts, and uh, you know get into why this is such an exciting material for the F-Series line. Let's get into it. ABS CF10 is a chopped carbon fiber filled uh, ABS thermoplastic. Now it's about 10% of that chopped carbon fiber by weight. Um, so being that it's ABS allows for it to be uh, easily printed and allows for the material to be easily stored as well. So there's no, uh, not going to be any issues with uh, moisture or anything like that. Um, so looking at this sample part that I have here, this was a sample part that was printed by Trimex, so it wasn't provided to us by Stratasys or anything like that. Um, it was printed by us, and as you can see, uh, the surface finish on this part um, is just extraordinary. So you'll get great looking parts with the strength to match. Uh, here's another example just of a you know, sample bar stock that we printed, um, and you can see that that surface finish just looks, just looks great. So what are you going to be using carbon fiber for, or ABS CF10 in this case? Um, you know, anything where stiffness and lightweight um, is a must. So some key applications that come off the top of my head to me are going to be, you know, your jigs and fixtures, your end of arm tooling, where cutting any kind of weight while still maintaining that strength um, is just huge for those types of applications. So you may be asking yourself, Alex, what's the big deal with carbon fiber? So carbon fiber is best known for its superior strength to weight ratio. That basically means is that the carbon fiber is super strong and super lightweight, which makes it ideal for a ton of applications uh, from, you know, aerospace to, you know, your normal jigs and fixtures. What's typically done in the additive world is that that carbon material is chopped up and then blended into a uh, you know, a standard thermoplastic. Typically that material is going to be nylon. Now nylon has a bunch of benefits that make it, uh, you know, a, a no brainer sometimes when it comes to uh, adding with carbon fiber. So it's got a ton of chemical resistance uh, as well as, um, you know, overall strength on its own. Uh, the problem with nylons is that they are uh, difficult to print and they are very sensitive uh, to moisture. Now Stratasys has solved that problem by printing uh, all of their parts in a controlled environment, but um, on a lot of other machines you may notice, uh, you know, limited results when printing with any nylon material. So what's been done here in the case of uh, ABS CF10 is Stratasys has taken their ABS, uh, their tried and true ABS, and blended it with uh, chopped carbon fiber, about 10% by weight. And that allows for uh, superior uh, strength and stiffness compared to a standard ABS plastic. So that's ABS CF10. Um, I think it's going to be a really exciting uh, material for a lot of F-Series customers who are looking uh, you know, for the next stronger material to add to their lineup. Um, look to see this uh, material release uh, sometime in April. Uh, and it will print with standard print head and a standard modeling base uh, with a carbon fiber specific head uh, to launch soon after. Um, I would recommend, if you are going to be printing this, to have a, uh, a print head, whether it's the carbon fiber specific head or a standard print head, uh, designated specifically for uh, carbon fiber. Um, if you have any questions about uh, ABS CF10 or any of the other materials, products, and services that we offer here at Trimac, feel free to reach out. And if you want to see uh, a material that I haven't spoken about yet, let us know and we can add it uh, for the next video. Thanks, everyone. Mm -hmm.